Hello, my dear students. I am your 10th grade teacher, Erhan Kushar. For today, we will do the exercises about simple past versus present perfect tense. Let's start our exercises. Yes, before starting to the exercises, we have a, we have a part that says, let's remember. Let's remember then, simple past. What is simple past? Specific time in past. I was in London last year. Don't forget it. There's a time, exact time here. Or finished action. I went to the cinema twice last week. Or finished action plus four. He lived in Japan for three years. Okay? It means that he is no longer in Japan. What about present perfect? Okay, it says that on specified time in past. I visited London. There is no specific time. Unfinished action. I've gone to the cinema twice this month. Or unfinished action plus four. He has lived in Japan for three years. It means that he is still in Japan. Okay. These are the rules for what? These are the rules for simple past and also present perfect. Everybody. Yes, now the first exercise. It says that fill fill in the blanks using the past or the present perfect form of the verbs in the parentheses. In the first sentence, it says that Jane. In the parentheses, we have the verb go. Jane to Italy last week. It means that when you see last week, you have to do what? Verb two. Yes, Jane went to Italy last week. Number two. I that film twice this month. Be careful about here. This month. It means that I have watched. This is the time expression. This is the time expression of what? Present perfect tense. Tom, a lot of funny things so far. So far is the time expression of what? Time expression of present perfect tense again. And Tom has done a lot of funny things so far number four he took three kilometers every day last summer okay last summer is also what last summer is also simple past time expression he ran three kilometers every day last summer number five number five i there is an hour here and also our verb is tell okay I a lie in my life it means that till now in my life all my life because of that I have I have never I have never told I have never told a lie in my life okay this is the present perfect use Scott yes two days ago yes we see a go here and Scott Scott was not, wasn't, wasn't at school two days ago. Number seven, those two children out without their parents never go. Okay, it means that when you see now, we can also use present perfect form. Those two children have, have never gone out gone out without their parents number eight my younger sister number eight my younger sister really intelligent one she was be careful about here there is there is a sentence there is a close here okay time close this is called time close when the time close here is simple past don't forget it the other part the main close here till here the sentence is complete the main clause here should be what should be simple past form my young younger sister was okay was really intelligent when she was a child okay number nine i live in berlin now i there for five years okay it means that I live in Berlin now. I there for five years. I have 
been there for five years. <laughs> Number 10, there a really good program on TV last night. When you see last night, you have to understand that we are supposed to use what was or were. There was a really good program. Here is the singular form because of that we used was. Number 11, she a part-time job when she was a student. Again, here there is a close, time close here. And, and also this sentence is what? This sentence is the main close till here. Uh, because of that, she had. We have to use simple past. She had a part-time job when she was a student. Number 12, he football since, be careful, since he was seven years old okay okay number 12 and also he has played he has played football since he was seven okay i can't find my pencil cases okay i can't find my pencil cases it means that there's no time here exact time we can also use what? Present perfect. I've lost them. Number 14, day three years ago. Okay, day, well, what about here is, uh, let's say, visit, let's write it here. Okay, in the parentheses. They, uh, they relatives in the USA three years ago. If we use the verb visit, they visited. Okay they visited their relatives in the USA three years ago okay good <clears throat> yes second exercise here we are going to underline the correct one okay correct one okay let's start i lost or have lost my purse there is no time here because of that reason we can circle the right one. Right one is I have lost my purse. I can't find it anywhere. I at my handbag, but it was not here. But it was not here. When I see uh, here uh, close, close sentence, it means that the correct one is I looked at my handbag. Number two, everybody, for the second one, my my father my father doesn't sell or hasn't sold his car he decided or has decided to keep it okay it means that my father hasn't sold his car there's no exact time here he decided he decided yes here okay he decided to keep it is the answer right answer did you finish or have you finished your homework yet? When you see yet here, it means that have you finished your homework yet? Number four, Bill and Mary went or have gone to Boston. They must be having great time. Okay, Bill and Mary, okay, if I say they must be having great time, it means it is now and because of that, have gone to Boston they must be having a great time last summer last summer yes I there is because of last summer I was there and I I what I had I had a yes great time yes that's the answer here number five uh, born you know it you can't say I have been I was born in Manchester, but I, since I was born, but I have lived, but I have lived in Liverpool since I was born is the correct answer. Number six, number six, my mother recently, it says here, recently, very busy, recently, recently is the time expression of present perfect tense. My mother has been very busy recently is the right answer. Number seven, we a new house. It has got a very large rooms and God. There is no exact time and we can choose what we can choose. We have both is the right answer here.
Now, the third exercise, it says that rewrite the sentences. Let's rewrite it. I prepared the table five minutes ago. We are going to use what? We are going to use just. Okay, let's say I have just. I just prepared, prepared the table. Number two, she has already washed the dishes. It means that we will use what? An hour ago. Okay, let's change it. She, she washed the dishes, washed the dishes an hour ago. Yes. We didn't get ready for the party here. We will use what? We will use yet. It means that we haven't got, we haven't got ready for the party yet. Have we ever ridden an elephant? We will make the sentence using last summer. Okay, let's make the question. Did you did you ride an elephant last summer? Yes. This is the question using with simple past form. And number five. Uncle Scott took me to the school yesterday. We are we will use what already. Okay. Uncle Scott Uncle Scott has already has already taken me to the school yesterday. To the school, sorry. To the school. Okay. That's all. Uncle Scott has already taken me to the school. And number six, Julie has just watered the flowers. We are gonna use three hours ago. Okay, Julia watered the flowers. Flowers three hours ago because ego is also used with simple past. It's the time expression or simple past form. They have now been to Dubai. Okay. Okay. Now let's change the sentence. They were not. They weren't in Dubai. Dubai in the past. Okay. I didn't play basketball last week. Okay. We are going to use this. I haven't played. I haven't played basketball. Basketball. Let's put it in the middle since since last week. When you use since it turns into us Present perfect form since last week. That's all our body. Okay. Yes, now we are gonna do match the two halves of each sentence. Let's match them. Mark can't go to school. Okay, can't go to school. Okay, four or five days now before because he has broken his arm and he has bought him some flowers and he bought him two books in an accident last week let's make let's match them okay match the two house mark can't go to school because we are looking for because there is one point here in c yes c is suitable okay let's write here c mark can't go to school because he has broken his arm okay good good and b b he broke it he broke it yes he broke it and let's check the 
alternatives and F is the suitable one. He broke it in an accident last weekend. Okay, let's write here F. Okay, F. And three, he has been in hospital. Yes, in hospital. Let's see. Let's see. Yes, A is the suitable one for five days now. Yes, good. It can also complete it in a good way, really good. Or number four, he has never been in hospital. He has never been in hospital. Before is good? Yes, I think so. Here, before. Okay, here, before. And for the last two, his friend Frank has come to see has come to see me and he bought him two books or okay they are so close in the meaning his friend Frank has come to see him let's put it D here put it D here and he has bought him some flowers Frank came to see him yesterday and he bought him two books is the last one for this part everybody okay these are the halls that we matched okay according to the meaning and according to the structures and the last page right or wrong if wrong correct the sentence let's start it yes somebody has broken the window is that true or not I think that is white. Yes. He won two Oscars so far. There is so far no. Because of that reason he he has won. He has won is more suitable. He has won two two Oscars. Oscar hours so far. Okay. Number three, they ate Italian food last night. Is that correct? Yes. It's a good sentence. Mark didn't finish his homework yet. Okay, we can't use yet with simple past forms. We call that because of that it's not true, by the way. Yes, Mark Mark hasn't finished hasn't finished his work yet is the correct form and lastly we have written a story last monday no that's not correct there's last monday here let's correct it we wrote a story last monday yes everybody Yes, everybody. Now we have also started simple past and present perfect forms up to now. Yes. Uh, see you for the next lesson. Bye-bye.